Hello, everyone. Today, I get to interview the CEO of Accelerate Marketing, Ryan Steinolson, on some of the top questions that have been asked in regards to online reputation. One, which is, can I be notified when my company is mentioned online? Two, how can I monitor what people are saying about my business via social media? And three, what are some reliable online reputation management tools? So these are some key questions. We have a lot to review, so I'm just gonna jump right into it. Ryan, let's start with the first question. Can I be notified when my company is mentioned online? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, there's and, and great, great questions and great topic. I know that you did a lot of research and, you know, you, you found out a lot of these questions you know, from people that, that you're working with, you know, on a regular basis, you know, in our, in our company, sorry, marketing. Yep. Um, but, you know, and also you've done some, what we like to call safari and, and found out these questions as well. Yes, um, some by going out there research. and <laughs> <laughs> yes, we, we call we call research safari when we're going out on, on safari, looking to see where those watering holes are for the people that we're, uh, that we're serving and, and that we're trying to research. Um, we go to their, their native area to see, so we, we don't want to disrupt them. We want to let them, we want to hear what they have to say without, without, you know, being yes. too suspicious. In their natural or, habitat. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, that's why we call it that. So, uh, Allah, this is all from Amy Hoy. We've learned a lot from Amy Hoy. Um, so, bottom line though is uh, social mentions, um, Google Alerts are two really good tools. Um, there's others out there. Uh, Hootsuite um, is another tool that you can use. And I know you wanna you wanted to show your screen. Yep. Um, you know, Google Alerts is great. It's free. Um, uh, social mentions is, is really good. Um, if you just go to, but that's, um, it, it, uh, that link there, a uh, Google alerts is not the actual, that's just the, the support document about it. But if you go to, there this you go. There? I think that's Google okay. alerts. Yep. And, and so what you would do is you would just create an alert. It's very simple to use. I mean, it's like, so you would, um, you would put the, you know, type in your, your name or your, your business name and, Yep. And it's super easy. This will create an alert email for Crystal. So you would connect it to whatever account that you want the email to go to. And you can be notified on a you know daily, weekly, monthly basis. Um, and you can just, there you go. You, you would just create, create an alert. So click on create an alert. And ex exactly. There's one alert. And then let's just do another one. Do it. And then see, because there are other options. So if you type in like Crystal Horton, type in your name. Oh, I was going to do property management. Yeah, or property management. That's good. That's good. <laughs> okay. And then, and then, uh, no, wait, wait, uh, click, go to show options right next to it. Okay. So see, now you can, you can wow. go only the best results. You can go deliver to, or you can go to, you know, you can, how often do you want it? Uh, what sources do you want to pull the information from? You know, you can get, you can get much more specific, you know? Okay. okay. Automatic. Yeah, so you can blog, choose news, web, blog, web, video. video, books, discussion. Wow. Yeah, so this is this is a you know speaking of you know of a great way to do some safari, you yes. know some some research. <laughs> this is a great way to to do research on autopilot. You know you can you can have those watering holes. You know those, those places where you're you know your the people that you're researching are hanging out. You can have that audit those you know, all that content sent right directly to you. Um, you know, once a day, once a week, once yeah. a month. I love it. Yep. I'm excited about this one. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, and this is, you know, yeah. So there's, <clears throat> there's that. And then, um, and then, you know, social mentions is another one. And then Hootsuite is a, is a, is a real time. Yep. Social media search and analysis. So, you know, you can see the trends there and, um, so there you go. I mean, you can see what kind of social mentions are going on for, you know, accelerate marketing, you know, your company, your name, you know, a topic. And, um, and there you go. Very interesting. And very similar, very mm -hmm. similar in that you can, you can do an all, you know, you can yeah, search and content across the universe. There you go. Okay. Media package logo. Yep. Business coach for interior designers. Yeah. It's pretty cool. So, yeah. um, 
so that's that's what I would recommend. And you know, like Hootsuite is is another tool that that does allow you to take that content. And then the main thing that you can do with Hootsuite that's really nice is that you can actually um, uh, you can automate you can automate the responses, the actual engagement, the the outbound content that you're creating as a result of your research, your safariing that you're doing. You know, does that make sense? So it, okay. Yeah. So it, you can you can automate the delivery, <clears throat> and also it, it allows you to work as teams to do this, and it does give you some tracking, so you can actually identify some ROI with your social media posts that you're doing. So you can automate the delivery of content, you know, um, to Twitter and Facebook and you know, etc. All the all your social media accounts, so that you're your branding is consistent, and the nice thing is, is that if you're in a corporate environment, this is a, a great tool for you because you can um, have much more control over, you know, who sees what and who manages, you know, what platforms and what was said and when content's being distributed. You can you can uh, create a a content delivery calendar, you know, so that you can have a plan of, you know, when content's going out, that kind of stuff with Hootsuite. Okay. Suite. okay. That's really interesting. Okay. Yeah, there's um, other tools out there, but yeah. Next question, Ryan. How can I yep. monitor what people are saying about my business via social media? Um, well, that's that, and that's the same thing. I mean, this yeah. is so social, same thing, you know, that I would do is, is, is these tools. I would use, you know, Hootsuite, uh, social mentions, you know, Google Alerts, um, oh, there's another one that is like the the one that we've used, and I just it's escaping my mind. But it's <clears throat> it's one that um, I'll, it'll come to me in a second. But um, <laughs> this is definitely what I would use. And then, um, yeah. And then I know you got one. You got one more question, right? <clears throat> yes, one more question, and that is, <clears throat> what are some reliable online reputation management tools. Well, and you know, you and I have been talking about this for about the past week as we've been talking about reputation management and marketing. Mm -hmm. um, and, and by the way, I mean, I, I think that you, you know, I, I also have to say that when you're talking about reputation, you can't talk about reputation and not talk about reputation marketing, like reputation management. It's like, it, it's so funny how, you know, I, they go hand in hand. You can't, but people don't, I think it's so important to distinguish that they're two separate things. Yes. And most people do a great job of monitoring, which is what we've been talking about, mm -hmm. of monitoring their reputation, like the, <clears throat> the, the, um, the top directories out there that your business is on, like Google My Business, Bing, Yahoo, Yelp, et cetera. Those are the top, what we call directories, which are just, you know, online directories of, of, businesses. So in other words, it's, it's a, it's a repository of your name, address, and phone number and additional information about your business, just like the yellow pages used to do for us in a book format. It's now online mm -hmm. and that's what these directories are. <clears throat> it's also yes. a great place and, and, you know, it's a great place for reviews as well. And reviews, by the way, are becoming much, much more important. Um, as we go in, into an era, 20% of people now are doing searches with voice. And your business will not show up when people type in best taco stand near me or best taco. It best implies top rated. And uh -huh. if you're not top rated, you ain't showing up in voice search. And, um, <clears throat> and so, you know, um, so it's, it's ubiquitous. I mean, it's, it's, it's everywhere and, and it's, it's more, it's going to become more your reputation and the management of your reputation is going to become more and more and more important as time goes on. And if people, they say by 20, by uh, 2020, 50% of searches will be voice. Yeah. And, and, and I'd say that more and more people are going to be type are going to be verbally saying best mm -hmm. as opposed to typing in best. And so if me. you're not best, yeah, if you're not best near me, I, you know, if, you, if you're not best attorney near me or best dentist near me mm -hmm. and best implying, you know, top reviews, mm -hmm. then you're not going to, you're not going to be mentioned by Alexa or Cortana or Siri, uh, 
you know, when, or, um, you know, Google assistant, Mm -hmm. um, just, just a fact, you know? And so it's important to manage these things and to monitor what's going on. So in other words, the first step in managing is, is to, is to be aware. If you're not aware, then you can't, you can't take any action. So the monitoring of these directories is a separate animal really from just what we've learned about this morning from, you know, Google alerts, et cetera, because sometimes those reviews are not showing. I want to know about those reviews, like what is like immediately when they happen. Yes. And so it's important to leverage a system that <clears throat> in the management phase of reputation of your reputation, you're made aware of what's going on. Now you can get notifications from Google, my business, um, without having a reputation management system, you know, Yelp and Google will let you know if you give them an email, they will tell you when you get a review, they will, they will notify you like within, I'd say almost immediately. I mean, yeah, Mm -hmm. you, you get notified immediately with when a Google, my business review comes in. Um, and same for for the most part with Yelp. Now the other thing, but you know, yp.com, you know, et cetera, you really need a reputation management system in order to monitor the top 15 to 20 different directories out there so that you know when you get a review so that you can respond to them and um, and potentially have that review either changed or um, maybe even address it before it goes live like we were talking about the past couple of days with the first party review, which you have much more control over, yet Google weighs very heavily in the search results. If you're not using schema, um, you know, schema markup for your first party reviews in order to show them off, then you're probably not going to show up in the voice, in the voice search because schema markup is what voice search uses in order to identify whether or not there's, there you go, schema.org. And, and you can find out if your, if your website is using schema or not. And I didn't want, I know this is not a topic, you know, we're not talking about schema right now, but it does tie in um, to your, you know, to your reputation and your monitoring. Because if you're, I just want you to understand the pain <laughs> that you can experience as a business owner. If you don't do this stuff, you will experience significant pain. And sometimes it's, it's like the silent killer, you know, it's like, Mm -hmm. you know, the heart attack, you know, like you don't know that, that one might be coming on and, and you might not have any premonition of it. Um, and you might not even know that, 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 that underlying stuff is happening in the background, but it's happening. And, and again, this is why the monitoring component is so important because if you don't know what's going on, you can't take the action and it can really cripple your business. I mean, you might not find out for five or six months and all of a sudden you're like, wait a second, what happened over the past five or six months? We're down like 30, 40, 50% in the number of phone calls we're getting. Mm-hmm. What the heck happened? Yeah. Well, nine times out of 10, when you go back and you look at what, what, what happened, it's, you weren't monitoring your reputation. You didn't know that you had, you know, you didn't have social mentions turned on or Hootsuite or, or, you know, Google alerts Mm -hmm. so that you'd be notified that somebody, you know, said something bad about your business on, you know, on a, on a blog that now is ranking first, you know, for, you know, the word, the keyword, which is your business and your city. So people are seeing that article about your business you know, all of a sudden and hence, you know, people aren't going to call you. Like you might be on ripoff report. You know, there might be a, a ripoff report article written about your business. And if you don't have, you know, Google alerts turned on, you're not going to be able to know about that. And you're not going to find out until it's too late. And it's, that's why I say it's the silent killer. It's, it's what, yeah. you know, you, you won't find out about until maybe even a year later. And you here you, you you've probably lost millions of dollars worth of business. Yeah. You know? Yeah, definitely. Um, so we're out of time, Ryan, I thank you for your time and for answering those top questions um, that are out on the web. Everyone's asking and wants to know <laughs> in the links below. I invite you to take our 45 second quiz 
and find out what your online reputation score is. We have that link there. Mm -hmm. Also, if you have any questions for us, send us a message at m.me forward slash accelerate marketing. That link is in there as well. And so yeah. every Monday through Friday, mm -hmm. we're live sharing some successful strategies with you on how to become the go-to business in your niche. <laughs> this week was all about online reputation. Next week is local SEO. And the week after that is Google My Business. Anything else you'd like to add before we finish, Ryan? Yeah, I mean, the other thing is I want you guys to really, you know, go ahead. I'm, I'm writing in the process of, of having a book published uh, about, you know, this, this topic that we talked about today and also about a, a much broader topic, which is, you know, how do you get your message out there? You know, what do you what system do you have in order to amplify what you're trying to say? and how you're trying to reach, reach the market. And so, you know, engage with us on Accelerate Marketing. We've got a, a ton of great tools that will help you either improve your reputation, um, uh, because that's one of our foundation products is reputation management and marketing. Local SEO um, is another part of our, because those are really two inseparable tools right there. Um, that's the foundation. And then once we get that and we build that, then we start driving traffic to your website and to your business once we've built a great reputation and we've done the you know as good as we can initially to help you show up organically um as well because they all work together you know because people will see you know they'll they'll see your ad and then they'll look down and they'll see you on the maps and they'll see that you got a five-star reputation and they see you organically with your website I mean, that's like, that's the triple play. And then if they see the, the a video, like a review video there, yeah. um, you know, <laughs> it's like, then you've got the, the quadruple play, you know, and it's like, and you talk about an increased likelihood that somebody's going to click and call your business. I mean, that's, that's it. And so, and then the, the other thing, so we, I want you guys to understand, I mean, we can, we can, there's a reputation quiz that you can take. It's only five questions, tons of value. You're going to learn a ton and you're going to find out how, well you're doing in terms of repu you know managing your reputation because you'll get a score out of 10 at the end in less than 60 seconds and then you'll get six days worth of content that will transform the way that you're you look at reputation management marketing and i promise you if you follow the instructions that i give and the trainings that we give in those six days you will transform your business and and uh to the tune of, a, of an increase of 10 percent or more in gross revenue minimum without doing anything else. No other marketing, just reputation management marketing. And then, um, yeah, you'll see the, you'll see the power of it. So anyway, um, thanks. And, uh, yeah, let us know what you think.